five. And I think we're good to go. So let's load this bad boy up and uh Paddleful Boyfriend. Oh yeah. And roll with it. Paddleful right. Boyfriend. All audio looking good. Let's do this. Huh? Is that Oh. Oh boy, yeah, we are we are fairly far back. Let's do an ID. Why is this not working for me? Well, let's see. We can we can back this up. We can. All right. Whose is it? Someone from two dash two? Not a name I recognize. Should I go find their classroom? They might already have gone home though. Well, any teacher will do, right? Any dream will do. Sir. Oh, I forgot. I have to turn the background uh, noise canceling to get the snoring right. Uh, sleeping noise, sleeping noise, sleeping noise. Sir! <laughs> oh! Hello, Hio Goat! Did you forget to turn in your homework? I, uh, I found someone's ID card, sir. It's someone from 2-2. I thought I should take it here. Uh, oh, thank you, Hyoko. I, I can take care of it. Uh, huh? What? What is it? Nothing. Just... You did find this today, right, Tasaka? Yes, in the corridor just outside. This student has been absent since the middle of June. <laughs> How strange. Hmm. So then, was the card lying there all summer? Nobody noticed it. It's awfully clean, though. Shouldn't it at least be dusty? Anyway, I'll take care of it. Thank you, Tsaka. I forgot Bye, what the voice you were doing. <laughs> uh, all gym class. All gym. the time. God, That's so right. Strong. Gym class. Gym. Thick gym class. Gym class. Today is volleyball day. Cool. Take this Okosan smash. <laughs> Swab Okosan. Let's go. Have at you. Ta -ta -ta. I I forgot that it plays the the sound, but it doesn't automatically progress the text. No. Nope. Uh, vitality increased by five. Hell yeah. Cool. Cool. A beautiful autumn day. For all dubs. You're in a good mood, Okosan. Is your voice sound different? Cool. Okosan was granted a vision in his dreams. A, a vision? Coo, coo. A vision from Lord Pudi himself. Do you know the legend of Lord Pudi, Hyoko? Oh, cool. Christmas pudding. Clad in the feathers of the purest white, his golden pudding steed shining like the sun itself. Um. Alright, so at last he returns. Yeah, yes, yeah. And last the pudding is invincible was not the correct choice. No. I do remember <laughs> that. Blasphemy. At last he returns to his long lost home, guiding the pigeons to the pure promised land. Coo, coo. Yes, yes, Hiyoko knows the legend. Coo, the Lord of Pudding appeared in Okosan's dreams. The pudding must be nearby. M must? <laughs> must. Coo, coo. Okosan believes that one day Hiyoko might meet the Pudding Lord, too. Coo, Okosan must go now. Farewell. Oh, I can see he has a voice he's a different timeline of Okosan. <laughs> I think this is just this is Okosan's uh, post vision. When he got a vision, he became much more. Uh... <laughs> this is post vision Okosan. <laughs> he's been just changed. Different side of the the roost. <laughs> <laughs> what was that Lord of Pudding thing? Anyway, twenty two days later. Today is the school festival. <laughs> <laughs> Our class decided to do a maid cafe. I'm not scheduled to work until tomorrow, so I have today off. I don't have anything to do, so I guess I'll go look around. Coo, a coo. Unhand Oko-san. Unhand him at once. 
an all too familiar battle cry emanates from one corner of the classroom. What now? Hioko, oh, that's right. Ju just in time. <laughs> Ku, unhand Oko-san, or face the consequences. Oko-san. Oko -san. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Oko-san's on duty today, but he, he doesn't like the dress. Ku. Ku. Ah, uh, this is kind of looking like something Peter would start a protest over. Oh, that was you. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we have, we have two H names now. It's a little confusing. <laughs> We're fine. Ku. Okosan refuses these constricting garments. Real men fight in the nude. You can't go commando in a maid cafe. Come on. Look, it, it suits you. I whip out my mirror and hold it in front of him. Exclamation mark. Exclamation mark. Coo. He seems awfully... He, he, he... He's trying to court his own be-mated reflection. Well, apparently that was a pretty common thing for pigeons back in the day. He's never tried to court me. Guess I'm not as attractive as Madoko san. Sort of like Narcissus. Yes, exactly like Narcissus. In fact, to the T. <laughs> anyway, it's October now. Today is track day. <laughs> we'll be timing each other today. So I've made sure to prepare to be in top shape. I'm gonna I'm gonna save a little more liberally this time around. Don't save over the top right save. Just in yep. case. Just in case? Okay. Yeah. Uh, new, new, new save. Sure. <laughs> uh, right. Uh huh. Why is the doctor here? Alright, who wants to be doctor understudy? Doctor understudy? Paging Dr. Understudy. You didn't uh, know. I'm in charge of nutrition for all the athletic clubs. Your advisor asked me to bring steroids today, but... That's an obese bird. Cool. oko has no need for those. Cool. Bring oko pudding, or bring nothing at all. Somehow just as intimidating as screaming. <laughs> as you can see, your captain doesn't want them. I prepared this just for him, and I'd really like to see how his body will react to it. <laughs> cool. Oko said, Oko-san said, he doesn't want it. It smells weird. Cool. Have Hiyoko drink it instead. Um... Yes. Uh, drink it, drink it, drink it, drink yeah. it. It will make us smart. Makes us smarter. What? We'll, we'll like, pass one of our tests. Yeah, we'll pass one of our tests and we won't uh, be the laughing stock of, of the flock. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, <laughs> Whatever, anything to make the doctor get lost. Gulp, yeah. gulp. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point! No! What are you doing? That's not for humans. Probably not for birth either, but, you know. Oko-san knew he could trust you, Hiyoko. You are his greatest ally. Ugh. What was in that? And we will never know. But our wisdom increased it by ten. An interesting reaction. Thank you. This has been most informative. Okay, but what was in that? Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure why, <laughs> but I think it made me smarter. I wonder if it would have done the same thing to Oko son. <laughs> if it made him smarter. Yeah. Race you to the other end of the field, Oko san! Cool. Uh, the, the race car sound never gets old. <laughs> <laughs> Never gets old. That's his Ogosan running, man. Uh, That's all for today. Files are coming up soon, so make sure to study hard. All right. Yes, uh, Yay! Uh, uh, hey, uh, Ogosan. Cool.
who? What is it? I've been wondering for a while now. What is the pudding you're searching for? Ku, pudding is pudding, naturally. Ku, might you know where Oko-san could find pudding, Hyoko? Well, as a matter of fact... <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. If I don't alternate universe, Hyoko knows. Uh... It was the grocery store. Because we oh. tried the convenience store last time. Yeah. Right. Is putting some sort of euphemism for drugs? Nope. Or is it actually like pudding? Pudding is no, pudding, 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 of course. Pudding, yeah, pudding. Ah. Ku, indeed. Okosan goes at once. Wait, Okosan. And he's gone. Flash Ku. He's back. Ku. Oh. Ah. Hyoko is a liar, a traitor to the cause. Apparently. Oh, Neither have pudding. Ow! Okasan, stop! You're hurting me! Ku, there was no pudding. None at all. Not a trace. Ku, Okasan hates you, Hyoko. No. Why is this happening? So, does that mean you, like, failed the quest? Nope. Oh. Anyway, it's December now. We got our finals back today. <laughs> Between midterms and practice exams, this whole semester has been nothing but tests. Tasaka! Sir! You're getting better! Keep it up! Yes, sir! All you had to do was drink bird steroids. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, it's, it's fine. Happy New Year! But it's raining! <sighs> oh well. Damn it! I just. <laughs> shit! Damn it! I'd go to the shrine, but this weather makes the wilderness dangerous. I think I'll sleep in like a good girl instead. I won't be able to send out cards in this rain, either. Fiddlesticks. No, I don't surprised it. the postman even Okay! Up. Happy New Year, everyone! I hope you all had good vacations! I hibernated! What a shocker. <laughs> You're still hibernating! <laughs> Sir, wake up! <laughs> uh, um, I I've said this before, but, but your junior year will be over before you know it! Let's enjoy this time while it lasts! There's nothing special this semester. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> the third term. boyfriend. The most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. Third term! Let's go. Word. It's still light out, so maybe I'll go somewhere before I head home. Whee! Oh, tomorrow's... Oh, right, it's Legumentines. Legumentines. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll I... buy some beans. Beans. Okay, I want to ask, do you want to know what the best answer is for Oko-san? Do you just want to do what you want to do? Is it not the beans we got him last time? No. Oh. Lies. Well, in that case... <laughs> This, this uh, doesn't really matter, but but there is a better answer. If you, if you get them their, if you get each bird their favorite, they have special dialogue. Ah, uh, mm. today Legumentines is a holiday where you give beans to the boy you like, but apparently it used to involve throwing them at pigeons. Disgraceful. Ah, uh, who wishes to clerk? Good evening. Here for bean. Uh, yes. Is there a kind that you think is particularly good? This year's trend is towards these bean medley varieties, but they're a little pricey. <laughs> it's hard to say without knowing the bird question, really. Hmm, that's true. And sometimes the cheap ramen tastes better than the expensive stuff. I think I'll buy... Alright, Wh which is his favorite? Swollen hemp. Swollen hemp. Yeah. Uh, no, no better descriptor for yoko -san than swollen. <laughs> I'll take these. Simple birds. Simple Where's the beans. pudding pinto beans? I can tell you. If you get them pudding beans, he'll just be mad. This is not pudding. A shallow He's mockery. <laughs> Today's the day. The preparations are complete. Everything is in order. Time to give the beans to that special somebody. Okasan! Okasan, wait! Who? 
What is it? Oko-san was about to escape into the great outdoors. I have something for you. It's legumentines, remember? Here, hemp seeds! Exclamation mark. Coo! Coo! He seems extremely excited. Oko-san, um... A, a lot's happened since we met last spring. The, the semester is almost over, but I hope we can... Coo. Enough flirtations. Hand over the hemp, and no one gets hurt. <laughs> <laughs> he leaps at me, grabbing the package and scattering its contents across the floor. He pecks at the seeds with a motion and speed reminiscent of a jackhammer. I don't think he's going to listen to my confession. Maybe I should have told him before I let him see the seeds. Oh well, at least he's happy. He fucking loves him Munch. so much. Munch. <laughs> cool. Hiyoko is an angel of the pudding god. Come to this world to spread joy and goodwill. Cool. Oko-san will remember this gift forever. I seem to have earned his lifelong trust with hemp. That's pretty cheap lifelong trust. <laughs> this shit was like two bucks. <laughs> Finals are over. Time to coast along until spring break. Oh yeah. Is the track team doing anything during break? I should go ask. Oko-san, are you in here? Ah, there he is. He's a bag full of dried beans in a canteen. Is he going hiking? What what, what are you doing? Cool. As you can see, Oko-san is preparing to depart on a great journey. Mm. The great o journey? O over spring break. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Educate cool. the Arbiter. No, Oko-san has quit school and is going on a quest. What? Oko-san, you can't do that. It was a miracle for someone with a brain like yours to get into this school in the first place. And if you waste this chance, you'll end up a failure! Cool. Oko-san will not be stopped. Oko-san is going on a quest to seek the true pudding. What is the true pudding? It's not what I think of as pudding, right? Cool. Pudding is the ambrosia of the gods. Miracles in jiggling corporeal form. Treasure shining with the seven colors of the rainbow. <laughs> Is pudding beans? Those who partake of its wobbling flesh oh, I don't will like never that. experience sadness again. <laughs> don't like the term wobbling flesh. Too late to make your flesh wobble. Silence. Seven colors <laughs> of the rainbow. I'm not sure I'd want to eat that. You're you're serious? You're leaving? Cool. Oko-san never goes back on his word. I'll save. <laughs> Mark. I'll <laughs> <the> differences. <laughs> uh, Alright. Okay. Alright. Uh, go with him. Go with him. Come on. Come on. Why would I let him go at this point? Go, go, go with him. If we let him go, we just fail our romance through. So, like... <laughs> Yeah. What would yeah. the whole point be? I'm coming with you. Cool. What? Fair maiden, this quest will be mortally dangerous. I don't care. And if this yeah. true pudding really exists, it's I want to fun. find it. With you. Cool. Mm. Oko-san knows your abilities well, Hiyoko. You will not be an impediment. So you'll take me with you? Cool. Very well. Birds of a feather must flock together, after all. Yay, let's go! Cool. Until we catch the end of the rainbow. And so our great quest began. So the great journey begins. We ran for years across fields, forests and years. mountains. Searching ever onwards. And now we stand in the ancient, unexplored ruins of Pudding. Cool, cool. This chest must contain the Pudding itself. Help Oko-san open the lid, Hyoko. So, this is the end? Ha! Ah, it's... it's bright. Cool. Eyes. 
eyes. <laughs> there, there's nothing inside. Grant us eyes. A fake? What should we do, Oko-san? I guess this... Uh, uh, Oko-san? Clad in feathers of the purest white, his golden pudding steed shining like the sun itself. What? What? <laughs> Whoa. What is God? He is God. ascended to heaven. At last he returns to his lost home, Wait. guiding the pigeons to the pure promised land. What's wrong, Oko-san? Why are you talking? Nothing is wrong. I am no longer the one called Oko-san. What? I am now Pudi, Lord of Pudding. Perfect timing. Joining the stream. Oko-san was but my avatar on this mortal plane. I am now complete once more. Man, it is really a shame that my internet cut out like seconds before this happened last week. Mm. Yeah, right. I mean, suspense was worth uh, it. Uh, uh, Oko-san, what are you? I am grateful to you, fair one. I have at last achieved my goal. I am the bringer of true pudding. I shall bring about a world of pudding. What is this pudding you're talking about? Come on, tell me! Pudding is hope. It is the future. I shall now become the very concept of pudding itself. <laughs> That, that, that's not Newtonian! That's not Newtonian. <laughs> I have powerful. enjoyed our travels together. However, you must live on and forget me. That is life. If you can fulfill the concept of pudding, I shall be satisfied. I shall not live or die. I shall be the concept of ideal pudding, never in wax or wane. There shall be no regret. Farewell, Kyoko. Oko san! I don't know what the fuck true pudding is. What the hell oh, is true this pudding? This is a romance thing? <laughs> Whoa. And so the world was engulfed in pudding. According to the fundamental principles of Oko-san's new universe, every living being carries pudding in its heart. That sounds gross, painful, and actually a and short delicious. Little span. It sounds detrimental. You, you just make an apocalypse in a post-apocalyptic world. Maybe. No, you made an apocalypse of pudding. Oh, well, we oh. got credits this time. We didn't so, die. Yeah. <sighs> what? Yeah. What? Oko -san is sure now Lord sure Pudi. We got the end. The world turns into pudding. <laughs> yeah. yeah, everything is pudding. Oh, Oko -san sacrifice <laughs> has brought oh, salvation upon oh, that's us right. all. Dev Devolver Digital is part of this. Yep, Devolver yeah. Digital is responsible for publishing this. <laughs> Good lord. Pigeonation. By the pigeon, for the pigeon. Uh, all right. Wow. So, Great. so did we achieve romance? That didn't really kind of. seem like romance. Ending uh, number seven. Uh, it number was self-realized romance by turning into pudding. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, well, I mean, That's we, romance, I guess we but... dated a pudding god then? That yeah. seems pretty bad. I mean, cool, I'll take it. The Lord of Pud. Achievement I'll unlocked. Be thy name. A pudding odyssey. All I don't right, want to, nice. like, bog down your gameplay, but do you want to know a technical thing? Uh, you sure. A, a handful of the birds have two endings. Really? Yeah, and for a really cool, like, uh, thing later on, you have to get every ending. You don't have to do it now, you could do it later. Yeah, gotcha. uh, but I don't want to bog like down less, the gameplay. It's, like, the less good ending, so it's literally that, but they cut the ending short. Ah, okay. So does every bird have one, or is is it like no. specific No, ones? only if you okay. do. Okay. All right, let's 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 start this we again, shall we? Ourself. We have to actually name ourselves. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. We're, yeah, we're 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 going back to heckles peckles. <laughs> I guess on second ending, it's pretty easy because you have to choose the wrong answer to the story question. 
Ah. So I told you to save there in case you wanted to get it. Ah, gotcha. Without doing his entire route. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, yes, this is fine. This is great. Uh, back to Heckles Peckles, let's go. Oh yeah, back to Heckles Peckles. Heckles the second. Yes, display human portraits. For the brief three and a half seconds that we will see them collectively. We don't need this intro. Everyone's seen it before. Bird, 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 bird. Uh, is the so bird. Oh shit, teacher bird. I am a bird. French. Oh, yes. Ugh. Yes. <laughs> oh, anyway, it's lunchtime. Man, what a day. That reminds me. I got these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Ah, oh, yes. This this bird. Nageki. 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 Sad boy. Your brother problem. <laughs> you, yeah. Kinda French. I'm Definitely kind. Of, I'm kind of French. <laughs> ah yes, the, the creepy the doctor. doctor. Did that make him Creole? Doctor. I'm Creole adjacent. <laughs> I'm Crayola. <laughs> <laughs> and bye, Oko-san. Goodbye. All right. you again. So, what what bird do we want to? Do we want to go for this time? Yeah, it's up to you. It's always see. such a hard choice. It is. It is a very difficult decision. After the obvious choice happens. Yeah, it's like. <laughs> what well, do we do here? Out of a hat. I think we should go with the douchebag. I yeah. Which, I, which, which douchebag? Douche okay, Can fair. Well, there's two French birds. So that so, one. Sakia. Do you want? Do you want, oh, want yeah. Sakia or you? Yeah. Is yeah. there a Sakia. German bird? No. No. Not that I know of. Nine. You can make a German bird. <laughs> you could. Ah, uh, yes. Make the doctor German. Awesome. Wonder what I should I do. A... I also, I would also, oh, if here's it's the possible, choice. I would also like to see you date the creepy doctor, but I don't know if he's a dateable <laughs> person. Uh, so, yes, you can date yeah. the creepy doctor. Awesome. All right. So to so... get to to go onto the okay, true ending the path, you have to creep date the creepy doctor among everybody else. So you know we're gonna have to do it eventually. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. so that is officially the our. Creepy doctor. <laughs> That is officially our, like, <laughs> starting point safe. Starting point safe. So we don't have to fast forward first. through everything. Uh, yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going to join the student council then. He's automatically the council president. <laughs> That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun. Okay. All okay. right. <laughs> Today's an elective day. Alright. Student council president, or student council, I feel like charisma. Yeah. Is like, mm. probably important. It sounds important. Speaking of sounding important. No. F. My internet <laughs> cut out. Aww. Aww. That one guy kind of looks like Robin Williams a little bit. Oh, yeah. We sang birdie melodies. It's a little tiring, but singing together is fun. I'm curious what this tune is. I guess, well, I, I could find that out at a later time, but. I'll tell somebody who already knows the answer and probably just look it up. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Heckles leveled up. Charisma increased by five. Dinked. I was pretty sure I wanted to join it, but what does the council do again? We skipped the council. vote, and I think it's only Sakuya and me. Anyway, he called a meeting, so to the council room I go. This looks like a CEO's office. Naturally. Do you think I would stand for anything less? Uh, hi, Sakuya. Uh, so, you had this done? Humph. This room used to be filthy. Better suited to rabbits than us. This is gonna be a great run. What a prig. Prig. French indeed. <laughs> Have you decided which position you'll take? I get to choose? Who is there to choose for you? 
dumb Japanese. <laughs> Jesus. Aren't you aren't you Japanese too, Sophia? Jesus. <laughs> Do not mock me. I am French. Yeah. Oh, Fre yeah. <laughs> French noble asshole. bird. That sounds delicious. Jesus, get a little get a little for that. I guess I have to pick a post now. I think I'll be the save point. <laughs> hmm. Excellent choice. Interesting choice. The that is an interesting point. choice. Uh, I mean, vice president. Vice president. Vice president. You, know, you, should be, you should be treasurer so you can embezzle. Yeah. <laughs> that is a good point. Commit tax fraud. You wish to be my right wing. Ha <laughs> yeah, ha. bird punch. You've got nerve. I like yeah. that. Shit, the correct choice. I think I you just like got it, bonded with. Ugh. Gosh, he looks pretty happy right now. Ew, disgusting. And so I became the vice president of the student council. We are officially now bonded blood brothers. <laughs> ah, sitting at home is so relaxing. <laughs> oh, tomorrow is the class hike. Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, health first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Today is the hike. We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Uh, so Sakuya. They gotta be biased again. Unacceptable. Uh, and a temper as usual. Why? Why do I have to come to a place like this and on foot? It's a hike, Sakuya. You have to walk. For what purpose? As exercise? Foolishness. Exercises for peasants. No, for fun, silly. You're supposed to enjoy the change of scenery. Look over here. Don't we have a nice view? Saki, it looks like he still has something to say, but he reluctantly comes over to me. I think maybe he's acting angrier than he really is. Sheesh, what a kid. Sheesh! What, a, what Sheesh! an absolute Sheesh! child. All of us have to live in Sheesh! caves. <laughs> Attend musica. Music class. Hurrah. Today is a music history lesson. So much thinking outside the box. Ah! Ah! Uh, I feel like I'm going to. F I feel like I'm going to fly what? off the handle. Uh, <laughs> but this is what Mozart is all about, I guess. Most tart. It's all about it. Most of a star. <laughs> I wonder what those wigs felt like. They looked like they were wearing ptarmigans. Ptarmigans. ptarmigans yeah, the peace the peace silent. Ah. Do you seek to mock the great masters, lowborn Philistine? I think that's yet again racist. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Entirely possible. This is racist. Oh, he was gonna be racist. Let's be real. Heckles leveled I mean, up. He is oh, French, boy. so. You've become five racists. Oh, no, so no, no, oh. no. No, no, no. We were just talking, Wait. Uh, just, just, we were just talking music puns. Remember, always finish on the Bach, never on the pussy. I imagine you're all well aware, <laughs> but <laughs> the sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival Please. season already. Ooh. If it were in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival, so it's always been in May. What are you going to do, Ryota? I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Somebody has to. Cool. Oko-san will handle the marathon. Indeed, he will. You do have a lot of stamina, Oko-san. What about you, Sakuya? You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? It is a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? How about being a cheerleader? The general, in other words. Very well. Leave it to me. Uh, I don't think this will actually be really interesting. Not the coach. Uh -oh. Very this will be very interesting. He's oh, in yeah. for some disappointment. 
Also, uh, the first aid team is always short-handed, so I'm sure they could use a help use help if uh, if anybody eh, any birdie still can't decide. That's all for today. First doing aid team can race. stay short-handed. Okosun's running the marathon, and Saki is a cheerleader. You, you might be running the first aid tent. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. And then I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> You never did. <laughs> Today's the sports festival. I never did make up my mind. What should I do? Go to the cheerleaders <laughs> library. Generals. No. Go to the general team. There is something of a crowd around our cheerleaders. I see Sakuya and a brass band. That's <laughs> that's overdoing it. I, heard it so I, I think I saw something similar during the changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace. You're here! You're not cutting any corners, I see. Naturally not. Only the best from a label. Maybe too much. Sir, oh, preparations are complete, sir. Your oh. orders, sir! <laughs> Very well. Begin! And so the band began to play. Where did he get these people? They all look like professionals. Shouldn't cheerleaders be students? You join in. Um, okay. I seem <laughs> to be in charge of the symbols. <laughs> the lap what? of those symbols. One wrong slip and I'll be the laughing stock of the playground. Yikes. Cool. Saki is conducting is awfully flashy. <laughs> is this the LaBelle style? The first barrier for all students who make it this far. The midterm exam. We're getting them back today. Uh, I, I don't think I did too well. Pickles! Yes! Uh, <laughs> no, I, didn't, I don't think you did too badly. Yeah? <laughs> nope, sorry! Nope, nope! Or you, real bad. Real bad. Oh! <laughs> you, uh, you should try harder next time, okay? Uh, I disappointed Mr. Nanaki. I'll have to study more from now on. Or just steal bird steroids, I guess. <laughs> or and steal I bird don't. steroids. Ah, oh, it's the nicest day of the year. With the festival nice. and the midterm over, there's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. Doves smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. Gross. Huh? There's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya. Yuya, what's going on? I think Tim was Yuya last time, so we made it an understudy. Yeah. Uh... I don't remember how he voiced it. It's very <laughs> similar to me. Yeah. <laughs> Salutations, Heckles. Ryan won his seventh Pulitzer. He gestures, he gestures. at a news oh, clipping sorry. on the staff room pinboard. <laughs> it says, Brian, the first intelligent pigeon, crowned again. Brian. Don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... He's the world's most famous blogger. He began when the birds were barely intelligent. He's a very skilled and insightful writer. He was the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called... I hate this. Ugh. <laughs> the Pidgeot Olympics. <laughs> He's extremely influential. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, mon ami? Try oh, googling <laughs> Brian Pigeon. Okay. <laughs> Funny thing, if you Google it, uh, there is a Twitter account called Brian Pigeon, but it has been dead for years. Because oh, uh, remember, that it did come it's out like twelve long. years ago. Yeah, yeah it's true. Brian Pigeon not that long. Never tell me. I can. Oh. Uh oh, lunch is nearly over. I do echo. Okay, bye, I guess. I'd better hurry back to class. I had the peak on my frozen pizza. Hello, every bear. Huh? There's a pile of overturned desks <laughs> in the middle of the floor. Oh, right. <laughs> the smackdown. <laughs> Ryota is overturned next to them. <laughs> Rock doves, underwings, and bellies are light, so they look pretty different upside down. I mean, wait, what's going on? <laughs> uh, uh, Oko-san and 
Sakia are. Yes. I look I... up. I look up to see the two of them at each other's throats in the corner. I think we might have a diplomatic incident on our hands. What happened, Ryota? Sakuya was making fun of Oko-san. He called him a stupid mongrel who only thinks about imaginary pudding and said he was ashamed to be in the same class. <laughs> That's terrible! That's understandable. I we mean, know Oko the real! I mean, Oko-san pudding is, is a nutcase, and I don't know what he's saying half the time. But he, he really does like pudding. Either way, Oko-san kind of went for the jugular and... You tried to pull them apart and Oko-san used the wing attack on you. Yep. You're our only hope now, Heckles. Weird, you're a flying type. It shouldn't be that effective. <laughs> cool. Cool. Oko-san will not allow Pudding or himself to be ridiculed. You will apologize. You tell me to take back my word. I shall not. A mongrel like you hasn't even the right to speak to me. Cool. Oko-san is not a mongrel. The battle still rages, and it looks like Ryota's sacrifice was in vain. I should... Side. Sakuya. Side <sighs> with the ruling class. Oko-san, settle down! This is yes. a classroom. Yes. Cool. This is a matter between doves. Stay out of it, Heckles. You are a credit to your simian ancestry, Peckles. I respect uh, your judgment. You gotta be racist, but we're trying to help you? <laughs> cool. <laughs> I catch Okosan and throw him out the window. Oh, <laughs> God. Oh my, you defenestrate him? Oh, yeah, no. we fucking defenestrate Okosan. Oh, you man. You defenestrate the pudding. Just because you're angry <laughs> doesn't mean you can make a mess. Else? Come back in when you're prepared to be civilized. Uh, damn <gasps> French people. <laughs> Thank you so much, Babu, for your interference. Oko-san will remember this. <laughs> Oko-san will, shall, can. Okay. <sighs> I wonder what I should do during my break. Stop. Go. Sorry, what was that, Mike? I thought these were human-sized birds. No, these are bird-sized birds. He's <laughs> <laughs> uh, human. Uh, Saki was in the cafeteria, right? Or was that uh, you yet? Cafeteria was Ryoto and Oko-san, because Oko-san was trying to destroy everything. Hmm. And Yuya was in the store, because... Or, I think so. Uh, I doubt Saki would go to an infirmary. I don't think he'd go to the infirmary. Uh, maybe we yeah. should just go shit on Yuya. Yeah, we could... Yeah, oh. Let's come to the store. To, to the store? Is, 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 he, is he at the store? Is he at the store? I don't... Said, no, I don't I mean, think Yuya we... was at the store. Yeah, oh, we went to the store once. I don't remember who was there though. Go to the store. That seems like the right direction. Okay. Go I was gonna say store. if we make if we make one bum choice, it's I'll fine. I'll make the yeah. you, you scum saved. We're good. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> you don't need a perfect record. I don't really need anything, but I think I'll go to the store. I've never really looked around there before. Wow, they've got all sorts of things for sale. Though with these nest building materials. Oh wait, oh shit! That means I have to hear you say this line again. Fuck. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, this line. Look like what you'd find in a human store's trash. My, Accurate. how mature of you, Monami. Planning to settle down already? Ah, oh, Yuya! No, 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 that's, that's not it. I, I'm still a high school student. Hmm, <laughs> that may be oh, so. Yeah. But you know we doves okay. reach sexual maturity within a year of birth. They, they do? Seems a little hasty. That, that aside, what are you you here to buy, Yuya? Your love, of course. What? My, yeah. uh, I... Yuya, that's, uh... We're, Damn French we're, we're, we're not! <laughs> I'm not good enough? No. Oh, well, I'll have to try again. <laughs> Is this how he talks to every girl he meets? Fucking uh, rude. Let it slide. Yeah, that's what it is. Nah, fuck this dude. He's that's rude. a little rude. I think, that's a little, brother. <laughs> I think that's a little rude, Yuya. What is? That sort of loose talk. Like I'm a game or something. You know, that's the first time a girl's ever said that to me. I'm surprised. 
Thank you, Monami. I will carry this warning in my pit pot forever. Adieu. God, I Achoo. hate you so much. All right, bye, Yuya. I guess. <laughs> what are uh, Musica. Musica. A musica. We all have to stand up and sing solos today. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm nervous. Coo, 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 coo. His voice is beautiful. <laughs> Crispy Crease by Fi. Oh, yeah. I didn't know he could sing either. <laughs> lovely. Bird, such a lo Bird has such a lovely voice. <laughs> Today is Tanabata. There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year, too. I think I'll go make a wish. Oh, there's lots here already. Any birdie I know. Ah, uh, yes. Trash words. Ah, uh, yes. LaBelle. LaBelle. Ah, uh, may they send you happiness, Mommy. So apparently I'm on, I'm on the Yuya track as well. Damn it. Damn it. I mean, I guess I'll save so I don't have to do that again. Uh, I don't think I need this middle save. This is like a beginning of Oko's on track. I think that was your yeah. Uh, rule the world from the shadows this time. We've already conquered the world by force. Uh, all right. <clears throat> I wish to take the reins of power through clever schemes and rule the world from the shadows. Uh, hello! Is that you, Peckles? Uh, Mr. <laughs> Nanaki! You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know. I was about to head home. Uh, would you like me to walk you to your place? Uh... Mm -hmm. Sure! <laughs> yes, yes, please. All right! I'm gonna come and kill you. Now he's gonna know where we live. <laughs> Mr. Nanaki demonstrated some extreme sleeping on the way home, but we <laughs> arrived eventually. I forgot he was narcoleptic. <laughs> Your house yeah. is very, um, rustic, Peckles. Damn, girl, you live like this. <laughs> <laughs> I like it this way. It's a wonderful place to come back to, isn't it? Wonderful indeed. He, he looks a little sad. Um, s sir. Ah, see you tomorrow. Don't forget your homework. <laughs> and so he left, a somewhat hollow-sounding farewell echoing behind him. Or was it just my imagination? Elective Ooh. day. More. More. Wait. How did we? How did we gain wisdom? Sometimes it bumps up over uh, time skips. Huh. Sometimes. Okay. Not every time, I don't know. Math oh, class music. Not I must become cultured. <laughs> I've been placed in charge of the timpani today. Ooh. Timpani has an I, not a Y. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Last time. <laughs> last time, it was the gong. What am I supposed to be? Oh. The musical gorilla? Oh no. You know you. <laughs> Bro, yes. you're the only one that can lift the mallet. Ah, <laughs> uh, charisma increased. Musical ook. <laughs> We're having a swimming class with the third years today. All these damp, tight, clinging feathers are making my heart race. Uh huh. God, yeah. I'm, I'm, sure. I'm concerned. <laughs> I am also concerned. <laughs> if you oh, live in a world of birds, your preference is skew. Salutations, Sequoia. Your wet suit suits you. Your wet look suits you well. Do you mock me? Hardly. I'm praising you. I'm proud to have such a handsome little brother. Your very act of speaking to me is an insult, Mongrel. You probably can't even swim. Oh, wonder. Want to decide who's faster once and for all, little brother? Fool, 
We already know who the victor will be. But to ignore a challenge would be a disgrace to my name. Very well. Mona? Uh, yes. Will you be our judge? I shall judge your noble combat with all possible fairness. Of course. Pick me when the race is over. <laughs> Just out of curiosity, who do you think will win? Well, and this my is my completely uh, biased opinion. My completely biased opinion of <laughs> not that I'm actually going for someone right here. <laughs> save over here, so we could probably just t go go Yuya immediately after. Uh, probably uh, 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 Sakuya. Well, Saki is an aristocrat, so probably him. That's so that's logic. That's logic, right? <laughs> aristocrats swim faster. <laughs> Even the hominid recognizes my superiority. Uh, Racist! <laughs> uh, <laughs> not harsh. Get Ooh. set. Go! They dive with perfect synchronization. Yikes, they're both fast. Even though their skeletal structure isn't designed for it at all. It was awfully close, but in the end... <laughs> 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 so, who won, Monami? It was almost too close to tell, but Yuya was a little faster. Did it? Oh. Well, there you have it, little brother. I can hear Sakia <laughs> grinding his beak in frustration. This, this is some sort of mistake. I demand a rematch. Sure. I'm always happy to take you on, little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, bird. <laughs> bitch bird. <laughs> bitch bird. <laughs> uh, anyway. <laughs> Maybe he's happy because he got to talk to Sakuya. Yeah? <clears throat> I'm in extreme emotional turmoil. <laughs> <laughs> We got our finals back today! I'm not sure I did too well. Fuck off! Ah, sir! <laughs> you didn't do bad, uh, you didn't do too badly, I think. Oh. Yeah. No! You still suck! Uh, fuck. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. Stop being dumb next time, okay? Yes, sir. I, I disappointed Mr. Nanaki again. I'll have to study more from now on. Or not at all. Yeah. Or not or at not all. At all. <laughs> or I will continue to go <laughs> to music class. <laughs> Today is the last day. The last day ever. it has been a semester already. Sometimes it seemed long and sometimes it seemed short, but either way, it's it's summer now. I think Saki has said to, to help him clean the council room before going home. He always gets angry if I make him wait, so I should hurry. You're late. I came as fast as I could. So, uh, so sorry, Sakuya. Let's let's start cleaning. Very well. First, move the shelf and chairs. There's dust underneath. Okay. Next, inside the cupboard, arrange the files by date. Okay. And then the floor. Polish it at least three times. And the window. Hold on. Are you telling me to do all that by myself? Who else is there? Uh, you bonehead! Maybe I should stand up to him. You help right. too! <laughs> <You're> fucking... <laughs> Sakia, I'm the vice president, not the charwoman. <laughs> <laughs> is that so? My job is to help you, so maybe you should be taking the lead role in cleaning up. That's why I'm giving you orders. No! Jeez, that's not what I... Here's a mop. Work! I... You... What? You know how to use it, right? Let's get started. <sighs> Don't tell me you've never... Of course not. Talk about living in the lap of luxury. Oh. And so, Sakuya reluctantly helped me clean. 
I don't have a license to operate this. I thought he might complain for a while. And he did. But he certainly can be obedient. Now then, the sooner we finish, the sooner we get to go home. It's easy to fall out of practice and get fat and lazy during summer vacation. A hunter-gatherer's body is her way of life. So maybe I'll go running today. Ah, yes. Totally normal. Totally, completely totally normal. Totally. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Ah, that was a good run. A true running girl's way to start vacation. I wonder how far I ran. I always lose track of where I'm going once the runner's eye kicks in. Where am I? Must have wandered out of my usual stomping ground at some point. Which way did I come from? Don't fail me now, Paleolithic homing instinct. <laughs> the sun's setting. I'd rather not sleep outside. Hey, you. I don't know you. Where'd you come from? A sparrow stands next to me, squinting up at my face. Her wing is resting on a motor scooter. It looks a bit vintage. How cute! I feel a strange pressure. I can tell right away that this sparrow isn't just any birdie. Uh, I'm from St. Pinginations. I was out for a run and got lost. Fucking love this music. You ran all the way from there? You must be good. It's about a two hour drive from here. What? I guess that's why my legs hurt. Uh, I wonder if I'll be able to run home again. Hmm. I like the cut of your jib. Anyone that determined deserves a ride home. Come on. The intimidating sparrow gestures at her scooter. It's a little small, but we should both fit, I think. So it's a bird sized <laughs> scooter. <laughs> yes. Yeah, uh, everything's human size. Thank you. Oh, uh, no. may, may, I, may I ask your name? Koshiba Azami. I sell Takayaki. Call me Azami. Then thank you, Azami. You're a very cautious driver. Carve it into your soul, kid. <laughs> <laughs> One accident is all it would take, and that would be the end of both our lives. It may seem strange to a young girl like you, but once you've lost someone, you'll understand. There is a far-off look in her eyes. I'm sure you know what you're talking about, but at this rate, I might get home faster by walking. Do you think we'll get there by dawn? Carve it into your soul. <laughs> the speed limit for scooters is 30 kilometers per hour. We're not even going that fast. Following traffic laws is part of my credo. Is it riding tandem against the law, too? That rules for humans. Birds are light, so one or two more doesn't stop the brakes from working. We're fine like this. I think it's but I'm not a bird. A and so we put it along at a zombie's hyper-cautious speed. By the time we got to my, ho my house, it was almost light out. So knowing how fast she drives, a two-hour run doesn't seem as bad anymore. No, it's yeah. probably like a mile. <laughs> <laughs> It's still a long time until the semester starts, and I still have a lot of homework. Maybe I should apply for a part-time job, since I have the chance. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'll, go, I'll, go, I'll get the job. I'll get a job. It's fine. I think I saw a flyer at the station hiring high school students over the summer. It was the cafe, right? Oh, we got to see him again. Yeah. It's well, we're also still missing Tim. It's beautiful in here. <laughs> Oh no. Uh, who, 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 uh, wants to, who wants to bird? Uh, I... Mark, no, would you no, like to, would you like to old man bird? I do appreciate a little town of Bethlehem playing it, playing in the background. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> it's very good. Also, um, the scale of things in this game is still ambiguous. I can do it. Judging by the context, I don't know if it's an, a human-sized or a bird-sized scooter. Mark, uh, are you saying anything, Mark, or are, we, or are you just... Sorry, I can't tell if your mic's going off or we can't hear you. 
I don't know. Jeez. I do I not believe he's, he's here at the moment. I don't think he's here. Never mind. Okay. Oh my. <laughs> Pardon me, this, but we're not open yet. <laughs> if you could come back at noon. Oh, uh, sorry. I was here to ask about the job. The proprietor of the cafe is an extremely elegant parakeet. A true gentle bird, without a doubt. This must be what people mean when they refer to a mature attractiveness. All the students at school are young and hyper, and the most dignified birds are... Dignified birds there are the teachers. Oh, is that right? Forgive me. <laughs> I am called Urushirhara Kenzaburo. I am the owner of Torime Cafe. I'm Packles Hackles. Welcome, Miss Hackles. I had a expected a human. Uh, you can uh, interview me or, or something? I do not see any need to test such a wonderful young lady's desire to work here. And I believe you will be much more capable than I am moving the boxes of coffee and tea about. I'll be glad to. After all, I am a vitality girl. <laughs> I shall be relying on you for this summer then, Miss Eccles. It is perhaps a little sudden, but could you start tomorrow? Of course. I am glad. I shall be waiting for you here in my cage. Tomorrow then, Miss Eccles. Okay. Did, did the bird sit in the cafe or the tree? <laughs> Great question. <laughs> Today's my first day working at Mr. Urushihara's cafe. I think I'll leave early to make a good impression. Good morning, Miss Eccles. Good morning, sir. Let me start by showing you where everything is. I'm sure you'll be remember, able to remember everything soon, so please ask if you can't find something. He shows me around the cafe, explaining everything inside. The shop is small, and he keeps everything very tidy, so I'll be able to remember it all. Well then, what do you think? It's very nice. I almost want to move in. <laughs> Come now, it's far too plain for a young lady such as yourself. Oh please, I live in a cave. <laughs> Actually, compared to my hat. Uh, excuse me. Um, I saw the flyer at the station and. Ryota? Hackles? What are you doing here? A friend of yours, Miss Hackles. Oh, yes, this is Ryota. You came for the job too, Ryota. Yeah, I saw that it starts at noon, so I thought I could fit in after my other job. But if you've already got the position, then that's that. Um, Mr. Arushihara, could you use two people? Sadly, my cage is too small to have that much work to do. I should. Be mean. Be mean. <laughs> Do the job I was hired for. Sakuya would be yeah. proud. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, Ryota. Or would he, because now you're working class. But I really... W oh, fuck, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I really want to do this. Don't worry about it, Heckles. I got a couple more places to check. Perhaps some other time. I will be here if you're looking for something later on. Ugh. <sighs> I'll keep that in mind, sir. Have fun, Heckles. Okay, that wasn't that wasn't quite as mean as I was. Uh, as I was he was just good. He was good at hiding his sadness. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Almost opening time. I'm kind of nervous, but I'm not about to mess up after taking the job from Ryota. Wonder who the first customer of my life will be. Oh, hello there. <laughs> hello. Are those nose holes on top of the beak? <laughs> that is how beaks work. I didn't know that. Y'all get a new girl, human. A budger, budgerigar. I'm a budgerigar. 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 Hang on. I'm... 
I'm a Bajurger from the south. <laughs> Bajragar. <laughs> Bajurgar. 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 A yellow bird. A yellow bird steps in the door. <laughs> <laughs> the first customer of my life. A young man who doesn't quite suit the atmosphere of the cafe. I was hoping for somebody, some birdie, who'd raise a few more flags. Maybe a white peacock. Welcome! Would you like a bath? Or, or a meal? Or, or maybe you'd like Mr. Urushihara? <laughs> what? Yeah. I'll take, uh, I'll, I'll take Enzaburo. Hey, wait just a minute now. Uh, the, the correct pronunciation is Budgeragar. Budgeragar? I'm a, I'm a Budgeragar. It doesn't sound right. It does. Budger a gar. <laughs> now you hear, miss. I'm yes. a Budgeragar. A, a perfect delayed reaction. Oh, hello, Rabu. This is Rabu, Miss Eccles. A regular customer. I'm some of an important figure here. See this card? 206 stamps. Amazing. Amazing. Is he a cafe addict? <laughs> hey, what was with it? What was with that when I came in? I I've wanted to provoke that reaction out of someone with a Kansai accent since I was a little girl. Thank As you, a what Mr. now? <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Rabu. Thanks to you, my dream has come true, and I can die happy. Y'all lost me on the roadside there. Well, time to stop working. Dreams done. Well, that's how it is. Eccles, right? That seat there is my private property. Y'all remember that now. Our new encounter in the little bird cage. Today is a good day. I shall make some coffee to celebrate. Please sit down, both of you. And so the three of us enjoyed an early afternoon pot of coffee. Wait, aren't I supposed to be working? Eh. Eh. It's fine. So then I said, I said. <laughs> I said, I said, it's just Foghorn Leghorn. <laughs> <laughs> I said, boy. I said, boy. I said, oh, you're a girl. Uh, I stayed out on the town for too long, and it's late. Now, on really my own, of course. <laughs> Riding the stormy waves of life alone is what we humans are all about. <laughs> Another new bird? Oh, 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 oh. what? <laughs> 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 Suddenly, I'm oh, surrounded by a bunch yeah, of unkept yeah. pigeons. You go to St. Pugination's there, don't you? Punction? <laughs> <laughs> Was it a punk pigeon? You get it? I bet a rich little girl like you gets a lot of pocket money from daddy, huh? Rich little girl going to fancy school, but I think she's so great. Darn it, I... I can't tell them apart. <laughs> I can pick Ryota out of a crowd about 80% of the time, but rock doves I've just met all, all look the same. I, I, just what? like the Italians. Do, do, you, do, you have some, do you have some business with me? If not, go away. It's not nice. Show us some cash first. Cash! They buff up their chests, <laughs> threateningly. Dumb punks! Picking on girls in the park is a good way to get ostracized for life. Eh, what? What? You little. They're angry now. My hunter-gatherer instincts can feel a fight coming. <laughs> Three pigeons on my own. Can I win this? Probably, realistically. Realistically, yeah. Slam. Slam. Fud. <laughs> the work of a moment. Some birdie flits forward, and in the blink of an eye, the doves are knocked to the ground, twittering in surprise. Looming majestically over the fallen doves is... <gasps> A zombie! Yeah. Yeah. That was close, Heckles. Are you sure you should be out this late? What the f- <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Me? Well... I'm a passing Takiyaki lady. The dove collapses before the might of Azami's magnificent kick. S -s -s Sorry, Azami. I let my guard down. Easy for a kid to do. Life lesson. Always be prepared. Speak
speak softly and drive a Sherman tank. Carve it into your soul. Yeah. Like She's yeah. so cool. <laughs> I think I'm in love. <laughs> drive a Sherman tank. Um, uh, Unzami, I'm working at a cafe, cafe near here over the summer. Can I treat you to something sometime as as thanks? Is that part of your credo, kid? Good by me. Asami takes the proffered flyer, mounts her trusty scooter, and puts off into the darkness. A heroic entrance and a cool exit. I hope I can be like her when I grow up. Probably a slow ass exit, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> we only get human figures for the romanceable birds. Yeah. Aw. Aww. Well. Today's the local summer festival. I think I'll go with I some mean, birdie. They made human art for her later. Oh, okay. Invite. Uh, uh, All right, we're supposed to be dating Sakia. Yeah, <laughs> sure are. I should have. I should have saved. It's Sakia. Let's go. <laughs> Sakia, over here. You've got nerve to call me out during vacation. What is it? <laughs> oh, right. You uh, you just moved here, so you wouldn't have known. Uh, today's the festival. Let's go together. Festival? What's that? You'll understand when you see it. Come on. What in the... Shops, food. Good fun all around. People can't possibly be eating food prepared like this. It's... It's unsanitary. It's madness. Don't worry. There haven't been any reports of food poisoning for two years. So there were reports three years ago. Yep. Yeah, logistics. <laughs> Guiding the panic-stricken Sakuya around the festival is a little troublesome, but hilarious nonetheless. And so the night wears on. Huh? When did you buy that candy apple, Sakuya? Hmm. They had an interesting color, so I thought I would buy one. I'm not going to eat it. I shall take it home and mount it in a case. That's gross. Just yeah, make sure the case people. is cold. You don't want the candy to melt. My prized oh, candy. Ends. Time sure flies when I'm in here. See y'all around, Kenzaburo. Oh. Hey, Heckles. Hmm? Rabu, finally heading home after s staying in the cafe for much of the day, gestures to me on his way out of the door. Here, this is your tip. It's... the magical candy from the pocket of an old lady from Osaka. What? <laughs> <laughs> so, young men from Osaka can do it too. See y'all around. I have no idea what that's referring to. Isn't it... Isn't it like, um... Like, English dubs will give... Is, is it Osaka that the, ac the accent is where they give, like, the southern accent to? Because apparently, in Japanese, yeah, people from Osaka... Oh, yeah. hmm. I don't yeah. know. Old ladies give you magic candy. Magic candy. Good day to you, Rabu. I guess young men also can give you magic candy, but I don't trust that candy. Don't take magic candy from strangers. <laughs> I think it's time to close up. Would you, like, would you care for something, Heckles? Won't be as good after sitting overnight. Is there any Tanjiro left? Of course. Oh. Here you are. There was a wizard on that teacup. Tanjiro from a fancy cup is the best. Hmm. By the way, uh, Mr. Urushihara. Yes? Mr. Rabu comes here every day, right? He does, yes. I wonder what he does. Is he a night security guard or something? A chauffeur, apparently. He's generally out all night. He likes to come here to relax before work. Uh, how do I say this again? Bajerigar. Bajerigar? Bajerigar. A Bajerigar who works at night? There are those among us parrots who prefer the night. <laughs> among us. Among us. Among us. The moon is one of the clear nights. Rabu is renowned for being a very careful and reliable driver. Here I took him for the type to go wild behind the wheel. Hmm. Uh, wild. Haven't I met another careful driver recently? I don't know. I don't know. Have you? I can't think of one. 
One more week until the end of August. I guess my summer job is over. I'll, I'll miss this place. Thank you for everything, Miss Circles. It has been a pleasure. Likewise. Thank you for everything, Mr. Urushihara. I think I'll be back here sometime as a customer. Y'all retiring early? Miss Eccles is a student, and so must return to her studies in the turning of the leaves. I haven't even finished half my summer homework. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, How tarnation did you do that with your mouth? Don't worry about it. Doing it's the last half in one week? I reckon you'll do just fine. It's a uh, it's a hunter gatherer secret. Yeah. Ah, you you singular human and your ways. Gonna feel real lonely around here without you, heckles. At least Kansas Borough ain't going anywhere. Naturally not. Rabu sips from his cup. I think after working here for a month, I can safely say that he accounts for the majority of the cafe's business. Everybody who comes here probably thinks of it as an oasis in the city, an island of soothing parakeet in the sea of urban life. It's kind of a pity that so few people come in. We're all customers. Oh, uh, welcome! <gasps> Asami! You came! Can't exactly refuse an invitation from my sweet little protege now, can I? When did I become your protege? I, uh, okay then. Come Yay! So have a seat, kid. please. <laughs> Azami, is that you? <gasps> Her expression suddenly hardens. It feels like the cafe is going to burst. It feels like one of those I... scenes when the retired cop finally faces down the mob boss just before the bullets start flying. That's a really specific metaphor. That is a very <laughs> painfully specific <laughs> metaphor. Do, do, do you know each other? You might say that. You disappear one day and then turn up sipping tea in a place like this? Left us all behind, have you? Azami, I... How do you think I felt these past six months? She looks ready to fly at him any moment. Uh, uh Azami... I, I don't know what's happened between you two, but Mr. Rabu is a nice man now. He, he drives cars and gives out candy. Please, for, forgive him for whatever he did. Stay out of this, kid. Doesn't concern you. Yeah. What, what, what happened, Mr. Rabu? I've never seen her this mad. When are you calling yourself Rabu? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Blaster. I remember uh, your sexy rapturous eyes back then. What? <laughs> you see you it. You be a living legend, kid. The leader of the toughest bikers around. Back then, there wasn't a bird on the night roads that didn't know the name of Hosokawa Blaster. Carve it into your souls. When we stand together, ain't nobody gonna hold us back. When I was young then, six months ago, <laughs> every one of us hell's birdies would have followed you to the ends of the earth. And we all knew we would have gotten there without a single traffic violation. S since when do biker gangs obey traffic laws? You don't get it, kid. Apparently not. You're still a rookie. You can, you can ride with the law. <laughs> I don't know what the rest of the word. When you ride, you ride on the inside. You're pretty famous for your strong ideals. Riding with the soul, as wild as any other gang, but never breaking the law. You were my hero. But a hero doesn't run away. You did. As soon as I confessed to you, you were gone. Done with the gang tales. On to the love story. Classic. Azami, I can tell I've hurt you. I'm sorry. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> but. Don't but. Don't say but.
but <laughs> tension crackles in the air. Only Mr. Urushihara remains exactly as he was when it all started, slowly polishing glasses behind the counter. So Mr. Rabu used to lead a biker gang, and his real fake name is Hosokawa Blaster. This entire situation seems extremely out of place here. Wait, haven't I seen the name Blaster somewhere before? Will you listen to me, Azami? It's a little late for that. Six months of tea and cake and you look like Mr. Fava Bean. Mr. Fava Bean? What? <laughs> 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 what? Oh my lord. Uh, th this... Jesus uh, Christ. It, it fits so well. Oh, thank God. I don't like fat men. All my hope for you burned up long ago. Jesus. <laughs> a zombie subjects Mr. Fava Bean to a harrowing tree, uh, tirade over his new physique. Come on, Azami. I got a problem with self-image. At this rate, Mr. Fava Bean won't be able to get a word in edgewise. Has she really stopped loving Mr. Fava Bean? I should bring oh, save, up... Save, I'm gonna save. 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 <laughs> I should bring up my love for some. I am absolutely gonna... This <laughs> route is so long. We didn't have any decisions before this point for this save, right? I don't think so. Uh, no, no, but this... No. Damn, I'm, I'm invested in this now. Fuck Saki. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fucking a zombie's scooter? Uh, scooter, yeah. Sure. Why not? Did you see Blaster somewhere before? Asami, I don't think you've forgotten Mr. Fava Bean. It's all day, Sackles. I think you, I think you think about him all the time, even now. What are you talking about, kid? I know it. Your scooter, right outside, oh, that's right. is emblazoned with his name. <laughs> ah, shit. Ah. Oh. Shit. I saw him when we first <laughs> met. <laughs> Writing his name right on her vehicle like that. She loves him, I'm sure of it. No, oh, you're You of still expression. like Mr. Fava Bean, right, Azami? I'm calling him that. Now his name. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> my name isn't... I saw it with my own two eyes! When you... Gave me a ride home and a lecture on traffic laws. You're pretty sharp for a human, kid. She's right. I haven't forgotten you. What a sad story. You left out even saying no. And I'm still chasing your shadow. Sammy, ah. Trying to sympathize with me. Nah, no thanks. I've had enough of that. You threw me away. And there's nothing that can change that. No, Azami, listen to me. Give me some dialogue. I've never threw you away. I, I didn't know if I could settle down with you. That's I was an outcast. I was a hero on the midnight roads. But would I be a good father? Probably not. Think about it. <laughs> Any guy with a panic a little will panic a little when the girl he likes confesses like that. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> Yes, but is the hero of the Midnight Riders really supposed to be that timid? I sat down and I thought I had to go straight, as you know. I couldn't have made you happy like that. You... I'm sorry I left you behind. I was planning to come back to you when I'd save money, but that wasn't good either. Maybe this is destiny. Like Billiken said, our souls are being tested even now. Fucking who? <laughs> Hasekawa Blaster. Your eyes look like they did back then. Azami, enough girl talk. Marry me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> of course. Uh, what? <laughs> Beautiful. That's so sad. Good, good run, everybody. The is it? That's the route? Wait, Fucking wait, no, 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 it's not over yet, stop the credits! <laughs> <laughs> this is supposed to be the story of my romance, not theirs! Who did that? Who started the ending scene there? Jeez. That was, that was kind of amazing, Mr. Urushihara. Yes, and a little excitement here and there is not a bad thing. And such things just make our lives richer. I wonder if my life is richer now. Who's richer? No doubt, <laughs> it is. Well then, 
A few more hours until we close, Miss Circle. Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, it's me. <laughs> Those who want to see others. I'm the blaster. Those who hey. want to be seen. The soothing mecca for all such people. Torimi Cafe, Poco's Forest. Don't know if it's still there. Tea next to chattering birds. Curry rice to die for. Is this is a real place. <laughs> I honestly don't know if it's still there, but yeah. At least at one huh. point it was real. It yeah. was in the past. Wow, yeah, that's cool. Ago. Huh. Hold on, I need to hold on. I need to look Is up this, this website. Game? I need to look yeah. up uh, a giant yeah. billboard for this restaurant. B i r d e a f e dot j p. Birdcafe dot j p. Or is it? Is it a C? Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah. It is a C. Yeah. It's birdcafe dot uh, j p. Stupid. Uh, the website is still up. I'm looking at it. Uh, I, I can't read any of it. Yeah, they have a calendar that's uh, still. Yeah, they're open from 1 p.m. to 8 p.m. on Sunday, Wednesday to Sunday. That's still there, is it? Yeah, I mean they have they have an up-to-date calendar with events that are going on. Uh, their most Shit. recent tweet was June of this year. Wow, wow. <laughs> that's cool. Oh, yeah. Wow, it still it exists. Still so huh. now I'm curious. Did this did this bird cafe pay money to have to be featured in this game or like? They might have asked. Just the guy oh, who made it was a fan I of doubt the it because the creator, Okosan, is her bird. Like, she took a photo of Okosan. And that <laughs> oh. Uh, oh, that's delightful. Let's see. Uh, mm. Tomi Cafe yeah. which opened on March 3rd, 2007, in Surumi, Osaka, moved to Kobe. Uh, Bronafelt tea, additive free handmade ice cream, and bird related menus at reasonable prices. Based on the concept of. Things that can only be eaten here. We have a variety of items so that bird lovers can enjoy. Huh. Hmm. Huh. That's very if sweet. If we ever go to Japan, that's a very delightful. Yeah. I think I think there's also a bird cafe in New York. I don't think it's related, but it came up when I was trying to look for it. Interesting. Hmm. Oh no, they don't have a reference in a bird dating sim. <laughs> I see where your priorities lie. <laughs> right in the middle of Kobe, just a little ways from Osaka. And if you still haven't had your fill of avian company, the zoo is just around the corner. Uh -huh. The excellent, fantastic Torimi Cafe. The birds are waiting here for you. As of September 2011, please check the website for more recent information. Oh, we just did that. I, sh I shall be waiting here in my bird cage for you. Cavity oh. to your soul, kid. Oh, ending. Okay. Love Blaster. Oh, two endings. <laughs> I said the game isn't over yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's never over. Oh my god. Oh, that was delightful. I love that route. <laughs> oh, that, was, that was so good. Uh, I, knew I, <laughs> I knew I should have gotten up when I first woke up. I slept way too late. School starts today, right? I'm gonna be late. <laughs> anyway, back to back to the game. <laughs> Oh, Pickles! Sir, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I overslept. I overslept. Overslept? Ah, my homework, I forgot to bring my homework! Aren't you getting a little bit of ahead of yourself, Pickles? No. What's the number in the top left-hand corner say? Oh. You're, uh, just a little bit early. Ugh. Uh, since you're here, uh, could you lend me a hand for a bit? Lend you a hand? I was about to start grading the freshman's exams, and I thought maybe you could help, if you don't have something else. Of course, you have a test in September, so if you want to go and study in the library... When have you been actually studying? Let's be real. Yeah, okay. When have I actually been studying? Well, uh, I spent our whole summer working. New save file. <laughs> I want to deal. Turn my <laughs> glorious abode. Return to my glorious abode. <laughs> That's um, what we did last time. Let's help Mr. Nanaki. Ah, we gotta work more. <laughs> you will. Oh, thank you. I'll go make us some sweet tea. 
sweet and, tea and was made of these. <laughs> and so I spent the morning grading tests in the air-conditioned green. staff room, like a proper little lady. This tea is very good. It has mango in it. I do like sweet tea. Did our wisdom go up? Mm -hmm. uh, good morning, everyone. I hope you had fun over the summer. Cool. Oko-san is always having fun. Yup, yup. What is this... fun? Once summer's over, time starts slipping by faster than ever. Try to stay focused. Focus, sir. Focus. <laughs> second turn. Oh my We're... god, it's only second turn. It's only second turn. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Ah, uh, back to where we started <laughs> at the beginning of the stream. A student ID... Oh my god. <laughs> Sir, I found this ID! Fucking take it, thanks. <laughs> I'm just gonna fast forward a little bit. There we go. Uh, back to music class, I guess. Oh no, I forgot my recorder. I don't think we have any spares. Uh, I do have my... Hishiriki, at least. Wow. You can play that? Apparently, my charisma increased by five. Them apples. <laughs> this late already? Let's stop here for today. We'll start looking at some new formulas next time, so try to read ahead, okay? No. <laughs> yes. Humph. The lassitude of Japan's educational system never ceases to amaze me. You don't like Mr. Nanaki's classes, Sakuya. What do you think? I'm not just talking about the math. Not only is attendance at this school mandatory, but everything it covers is infantile. It bores me to yawning. Go on. Hey, at least Mr. <laughs> Nanaki won't show you off for snoozing in class, right? I don't think that's the issue here, Ryota. Look at Oko-san. He conked out as soon as we took attendance. <laughs> cool. Zzz. <laughs> Exactly! These pathetic teaching practices destroy the students' motivation and interest! No wonder nobody takes school seriously. But isn't Mr. Nanaki a big name in science? I mean, I'm not really that well informed, but... I don't think it's very nice to go around piddling on him, Sakuya. Yeah? You are the one who piddles. We know his capabilities as a teacher quite well, Peckles. Do you mean to say that we should respect and obey him simply because he is a teacher? Yes. His... Well then, his fame is merely on the national level anyway. That's not, that's not famous enough. The only world-renowned professor here would be Dr. Iwamine. Yeah. Huh? The doctor is that well known? Uh, I never heard of it. Why do you think he gets to be evil? He's famous. Cool. It is Oko-san's pudding. <laughs> I am <laughs> surrounded by ignorant uses and fools. I I ignorant uses? <laughs> Ignorant. Are you are you deaf, baboon? Yes. <laughs> Ignorant muses. All right. He is a world authority on pathology. His name is known the world over. The French love him. Anyway, Nanaki doesn't even come close. I never knew the doctor was that famous. But then, why is he working as the doctor for a high school, even if it is a prestigious one? Experimental material. Yeah. 
Ah, uh, school festival. Ah, uh, maid cafe. <laughs> Is 2-4 doing a haunted house? I'm well known for my reckless nature. So maybe I'll go and scream a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, Saki okay. is free today too, isn't he? Maybe I should invite him along. Yes. Uh, yes. I will do exactly that. Saki, yeah. Do you need something? You're free today, right? Want to go look at Two Four's haunted house? Haunted house? A waste of time. Nothing but a foolish charade of commoners, by commoners, and for commoners. How do you know if you don't go? And besides, isn't keeping an eye on the masses a part of a noble bird's job? Erp. I suppose it might have some value. Since I have no other pressing matters to which I must attend, I shall accompany you. Mm, thank you. I hate it here. I, I hate it. What is this madness? A haunted mansion! What on earth is that? Will we be attacked by hostile ninjas? Oh, that would be a ninja mansion, silly. Obviously. Uh, Duh! But my nurse told me that any mansion is bound to have ninjas lying in wait inside. What? <laughs> Why would your nurse say that? <laughs> it's like a tiny theme park with a ghost theme. Hence haunted. How foolish. No doubt it has nothing but tricks to scare me children. We shall yep. enter. Oh, this is That's all it has. Oh, hey, wait. What trickery is this? I I can't see. Why is it dark in here? Uh, oh. <gasps> Who right. turned off the sun? You you can't see in the dark, can you? Uh, I stepped on something nasty. No, stop. Unhand me. I... Saki, calm down. No, you're not supposed to kick the poor ghosts. I kick. Let me go. Noble bird. <laughs> I've never seen him worked up. Th I've never seen him this worked up before. Anyway, I'm glad he enjoyed it, I think. <laughs> I need my therapist. <laughs> he loved it, see? Ah! Uh -huh. I had it in my recorder instead of my math homework! Jesus Christ. <laughs> what do I do? Is Mr. Nanaki still in the staff room? Oh my god. We're idiot! Excuse me. Why did Mr. Nanaki accept that? Huh? He's asleep, probably. Mr. Nanaki Ooh. and Dr. Iwamine. I hadn't expected to see them together. Hey, Mike. I was just saying, I, I couldn't remember the, the names yeah. that way around. Um. And you see nothing in peculiar about these numbers? Nothing at all! There is a statistical deviation visible in the data on the students from the past few years. I had hoped to get some insight from you, but... It would seem I have overestimated you. Really? Oh, sorry, I couldn't help then. I'll say. <laughs> we mind our own business, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll leave. <laughs> oh, but, uh, uh, indeed. If we're true, you know what to do. <laughs> uh, Every time I can. Of I can use steroids for the different That's not very nice, Doctor. Or well, what do you want? Uh, hi, Peckles. What is it? Uh, sir, I gave you my recorder earlier instead of my homework. Hmm. So you did. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Here's the workbook. Thank you, sir. Sorry, sir. Teacher like pupil, Shay. He was just like, huh, I guess he did give me a recorder. <laughs> Music class was fun today. Solo tests always make me nervous. <laughs> but they can be fun too. I sang well today. We have physics next, right? Huh? huh? <gasps> Sakuya is standing in the music room, staring at the instrument rack. What's wrong, Sakuya? Nice rack. What? Do you... Th do you think of the arts, Miss Peckles? The arts? 
Where did that come from? Surely one such as yourself has an opinion of some kind. What do you think of the arts? Uh, well, I'm not really sure it's something I could put into words just like that. Dostoevsky once said that an artist is a man who turns his ear inwards and writes down with zeal what he hears. Such a common idea. He looks... he looks angst-ridden. Hmm. I wonder if something happened. I wonder indeed. Finally done with cleaning! Time to go home! I can hear somebody playing the piano in the music room at the end of the hall. Who? I think I'll... Go look. Let's go look. Definitely go look. I can mm. see some birdies sitting at the piano through the door. I recognize him. It's... Sakuya? <laughs> How long have you been standing there? Were you spying on me? How unpleasant. No, I, I just came over here. It, it sounded beautiful. I never knew you could play. I'm amazed you can practice and still study enough to get such good grades, Sakuya. Of course. A noble must be versed in all fields, though I doubt one such as you can understand the art. It sounded wonderful. <laughs> I was about oh, to say, I've... it's nice he's not being racist for once when he says yeah, shit right? like that. <laughs> oh, I'm, uh, I'm distracting you. Sorry. Uh, I'll, I'll go now, so don't, don't mind me. Peckles. Huh? What do you love? You. Uh, <laughs> what... Why this all of a sudden? Tell me. Pudding. Hmm. Uh, yeah, U Udon, wrong, I guess. Wrong, wrong route. <laughs> Udon? Truly. Yep. I eat it every day. Mm. I see. I see. Thank you. Okay. Uh, bye, Sakuya. And so I let him, left him sitting deep in thought. What was that all about? Oh, he's going to compose a love song for you, and it's going to be all about, about Udon. Udon. <laughs> <laughs> we got our finals back today. Oh, boy. Back up! What? <laughs> <laughs> You're getting better. Keep it up. Oh, okay. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Did we fail again? Probably. It's winter break. The year's almost over. For some reason, that makes me sad. Oh, no. Oh no, did you we got fail? A letter? Oh, I you got an a letter. In a fancy envelope. Who's it from? We are holding a Christmas party at the LaBelle Mansion on the 24th of this month. You are invited. Be honored. Sakuya LaBelle Shirogami. Are you honored? Are you honored? Yay, I got a heartwarming invitation! Is My family's Buddhist, so I hadn't had anything planned. Family's Buddhist? Might, might as well go, right? <laughs> what? Who's your family? Wait, <laughs> are you <laughs> meeting? Are you gotta go. to tell me Buddhists I... don't celebrate Christmas? Yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what I'm telling you. It's like a palace! Ho ho ho! What do you think, Peckles? <laughs> Normally a commoner such as yourself would never set foot in here. God. It, 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 it's, it's amazing, Sakuya! This whole thing is far removed from my own uncultured Stone Age lifestyle. <laughs> I feel a little nervous. Do, do you have a party like this every year? Every year? <laughs> Don't be foolish. We have one every month. Creating a habitat for social discourse is a noble's duty, after all. That seems a little tiresome. Are you feeling overwhelmed already? Poor foolish comma. Communism. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh god, that's... What the heck is Oko San doing there? <laughs> I don't this think it's related. Lax pudding. Uh, Ko, you dog! Why are you here? I never invited you! Cool. Oko San sensed a feast and came in through the window. But there is no pudding. I wouldn't give any to you, even if I did have some. Confound you, you genetic throwback. <laughs> <laughs> Oka-san's going to go berserk at this rate. I think I should... 
defend him straight. Stop him. Probably stop. <laughs> stop him. him. Is what we're trying to do. Oko-san, inside voice. Yeah, you're being too loud. Well done, Peckles. Now throw him outside. Defenestrate him. Cool. Again. He's a burglar. <laughs> I am grateful to you, Peckles. Now we can have our party in peace. No need to thank me. I would hire you as a bodyguard if you ever so desired. Um. That's a compliment, right? Yeah. I think so. Time. The sun! Its majestic brilliance sweeps across the land, lighting it into incandescent Don't glory. Read it. It's the first day of the new year. Looks like <clears throat> I'm still alive to enjoy it. What does that mean? Uh, you know. Uh, it's a little no, cold you're not out. Dead. You but, live in a uh, cave. What do you think it means? But it's calm and the sun is warm. I think I'll go visit the shrine. There are a lot of birds here already. Must be nice to have warm winter plumage. Maybe I should borrow some from some birdie. I think I'll buy an amulet and go home. Heckles! Oh my. <laughs> oh no, he's hot. Happy New Year! Oh, no. There's too many happy returns, right? What are you doing, Ryota? Exactly what it looks like. I'm working here today and tomorrow. Uh, oh, it... It looks good on you. You came here to buy an amulet, right? Which would you like? Um, I'd like mm. one for... Uh... Art. Art? <laughs> Conquest. Yeah, art. Conquest. Sure. Conquest. Talking about art really. It's true, he, art. Was, he yeah. was an artsy fartsy. That's true. Here you go. Thanks, Ryota. Are you here all day today? <laughs> yep. First day is always busy. Oh, well. I, I was going to ask if you wanted to get lunch together, but... Sorry, Eccles. Maybe another time. Since you're here, why not go get a fortune? They're next to the main building. Oh over there. Oh my god, it's just like Persona! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Okay, thanks! I think, I think Persona's... I think Persona's Japanese. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wait, was he supposed to be a shrine maiden? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Oh god. Yeah. Uh, Mr. Nanaki, Happy New Year! Peckles, Happy New Year! Did you get a fortune, sir? Yeah, uh, yes, uh, unfortunately I seem to have drawn the chicken of ill omen. Why don't you take one? I will. Hmm, what should I take? Mm, this one. Java Blessing. Oh, you can be a developer now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> oh, good! You got a better one than I did. I think this will be a good year for you, Peckles. Thank you, sir. Wait, isn't that... Oh, Sakuya? Oh, it's you. What are you doing here? I hadn't thought you were the type. I am here to observe. I may one day be ruling this country, so there is no harm in familiarizing myself with the customs of the masses. That aside, I had heard the rumors, but this place is a battlefield. Some lunatic almost killed me throwing coins earlier. <laughs> oh, right. You don't get out too often. Those are offerings. They... Yes, I am aware. The custom was created by a secret policeman during the Edo period, I believe. I never knew. I understand that the coins thrown by this policeman also inspired the shuriken later used by all ninja all across the country. To begin the year by testing each other's reflexes in deadly monetary skirmishes, Japan truly is a brutal country. I can't tell if he's bullshit or not. He gazes he with mixed ninjas admiration all the time. and fear at the donations falling into the shrine box. Correcting him would be a pain, so I think I'll leave it at that. Yeah. Mm, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, let's let's not. Let him think what Please he only wants. watch Naruto. <laughs> That's Happy how he prepped year, to come everyone. to Japan. Hope you all have good vacations. I hibernated. 
What a shocker. <laughs> You're still hibernating! Sir, wake up! <laughs> oh, uh, I said this before, but your junior year will be over before you know it! Uh, let's enjoy this while the time lasts! There's nothing special this semester. Nothing to worry about. Third term. I'm convinced that after every cutaway when he's done talking, he just goes right back to sleep. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Not, not. Don't even have to convince me. It's still light out, so maybe I'll go somewhere before I head home. Whee! Oh, tomorrow. Tomorrow's legumen times. Beans. I, oh, I think I'll go buy some beans. 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 Me and the boys at 3 a.m. looking beans. for beans. <laughs> Today. Legumentines is a holiday where you give beans to the boy you like, but apparently it used to involve throwing them at pigeons. Disgraceful. Good evening here for beans. Yes, is there a kind you think is particularly good? Yes, yes, trying to start these bean medleys for races, but they are a little pricey. It's hard to say without knowing the bird in question, really. That's true, and sometimes the cheap ramen tastes better than the expensive stuff. I think uh, I'll buy. Yeah. Do you need a hint? Uh, let's see. What let's do we get? We get to save and get all the beans. Bitter black. He's beans. rich. <laughs> he likes rich things. Country millet. Oh, so the, the racing Malay. Blend is it rich? Oh racing yeah. Blend? Racing like blend, blend because it's expensive. expensive Malay. Millet. Yeah. Yeah, it's racing blend. He likes expensive things. Yeah. Racing you get him black. bitter black beans, he will, like, throw them in your face. <laughs> I'll take these. Thank you, miss. Here you are. That'll be $49. <laughs> $49 for beans? Beans. Yeah. Anyway, it's tomorrow. Today's the day. The preparations are complete. Time to give the beans to that special somebody. Sakuya! I'm busy. May I ask you not to waste too much of my time? This will only take a minute. I have something for you. Here. What are these? It's a pricey blend of beans. I know you like expensive things. <laughs> this reminds me of, just reminds me of a uh, prosy deal. <laughs> it's a rich person. What are these curious little circles? Poor people eat these. <laughs> you disgusting, Jeeves. Take it away. <laughs> That's... <laughs> That is not what I meant. Why are you giving me beans? It's legumentines. And what is that? Luther <laughs> doesn't even know about okay, legumentines. Right. It's a holiday where girls are supposed to good. give beans to the boys they like. <laughs> what? Don't look so disturbed. Jeez, I gave you those. Will you accept them, Sakuya? <laughs> These beans seem somewhat cheap for their illustrious recipient, but since you ask it, I will not refuse them. Really? Yay! What did you mean by like? What? Uh, I am asking what you meant by the boys they like. Uh, exactly what I said. No matter what I'm doing or where I am, your beautiful plumage always comes to mind, Sakuya. Um. Anyway, here! I hope we can continue to get along. <laughs> Indeed. Wait, do bird pigeons give them to human boys, too? Uh, well, you're that, the only human here. That is under the assumption that there is a human boy in a 50-mile radius. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Probably. Uh, he glances at the beans, and then at me, and then wordlessly leaves. I'm glad he liked them. <laughs> he he did like them, right? I mean, right? he took them. He, he took them, all right. Fair enough. It's cold. It feels even colder than it was around New Year's. Maybe the wind's stronger? I'm starting to think I should build a wall or maybe dig myself a new bedroom. What? I knew a thing about building walls. With this kind of weather, <laughs> oh, some no. birds are even collapsing in the street. Hey, wait. Isn't that one Sakuya? S Sakuya, what's wrong? 
Don't ask for the details. Just carry me to your miserable abode, I beg of you. Hmm? Wandering around and collapsing in the street at this time of night doesn't seem like customary practice for an aristocrat. What's happened, Sakaya? Don't tell me your family has fallen from high society. My family has fallen from high society. No! <laughs> <laughs> what, what happened? I shall not say. Eh? What were you doing wandering around the wilderness, then? I was not wandering. I was on my way here. Be honored. Hmm? Oh, so this isn't a coincidence after all. Did you want something from me, then? No. Don't flatter yourself. Eh? Uh? I'll come with your house. Let's uh, fuck you. Sh should, we, <laughs> should we call your family or, or something? No. <clears throat> he looks really angry. Listen. Don't. You dare. Don't you dare call my house. Sakuya, did, did, did you run away from home? That sounds bad. No, I simply left with my own volition. Violation. Uh... Isn't that the same thing? Mm, no. Yup. <laughs> what happened, Sakuya? Peckles, do you remember when we talked in the music room at school last fall? Yes. What about it? Do you remember what I asked you then? Fucking do you? you ask me what? All right, we haven't saved in a hot minute, so we're gonna, <laughs> yeah. we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna save. What I loved. You asked me what I loved. That's right, and you gave a simple, honest answer right away. And that. That. That made me jealous. Did I miss here? That's the last thing I'd have expected from him, of all people. I... I don't understand, Sakia. Why? I... I'm one of the few of the pure bloodline. I am ranked higher than any of my siblings. I have been slated to become the next family head since birth. There is no reason I shouldn't be. But... You don't want to take your father's place? How did you know that? It's obvious. It's written all over your face. <clears throat> cool. I... I love music, but my father does not approve. When I was young, I owned a number of instruments, but he had them all thrown away, liquidized. <laughs> Art is not our realm. The joy of creation is the domain of peasants. Our role is to be patrons and promoters of the artists we admire, not to be artists ourselves. A noble who sows his own wheat is a fool. That's not that true. Indeed. I think anyone who can play music should be encouraged, no matter who their parents are. That is because you think we're the peasants' values. My world is different from yours. I'm trying to make you feel better. Peasant. I'm not talking about what peasants think. I'm talking about what I think. What about you, Sakuya? What do you think? What do I think? You speak in riddles. I carry the name of Lebel. To play at applying my own standards and ideas to the world would be a disgrace. But didn't you just say you left the mansion of your own accord? Isn't that applying your own idea to the world? <laughs> You've contradicted yourself. Objection! <laughs> <laughs> It's finally bird attorney. <laughs> we are now God. bird Get attorneys. Him, Nick. <laughs> well, Phoenix, you've seen through my charade. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to do in life, Sakuya? I must succeed my father as the next family head. No, oh, jeez, that's not what I meant. What if you could forget about the LaBelle family and do anything in the world? What would you do then? Forget about the LaBelle family. What a mockery is this? We're speaking hypothetically, dummy. I don't have a hypothalamus. If I could do anything in the world, I would continue studying music. I would like to see how far I could go as a musician. He sounds uncharacteristically modest. 
I was half expecting him to give some rambling speech about how he would unite the world and become king or something. You... Unite you the love, world from devastation. You love music, don't mm. you? If I could hear you play the piano again, I would be very happy, Sakuya. I think you've answered your own question. Answered my own question? Don't be ridiculous. This is a mere fantasy. It has no connection to reality. Have you told your father that you want to continue studying music? Don't be ridiculous. How could I lower myself so? So, you haven't even asked him about it. You wouldn't be lowering yourself, Sakuya. You ashamed to love music. <laughs> you should ask him. It's worth a try, right? Perhaps you are right. I suppose I never would have thought of that if I hadn't talked to you. You were confused about what you wanted, Sakuya. I just gave you a little push. Pakuns. Yes. I'm going to speak with him when I return. If he refuses, would... Would you carry my fallen body to safety one more time? Are you planning to run away for real next time? If it comes to that... I will follow you anywhere you need to go, Sakuya. You will always have a safe place here, okay? I shall return to you. Thank you, Peckles. But maybe move out of this dank cave, please. And so he set out across the wilderness once more, babbling about some dank cave. I don't know if his father <laughs> will accept him, or if he really will run away. But I know he will come back to me. Maybe you should take a new room. And I pray... <laughs> that our future will be a happy one. Wake up! It's morning, Sakuya! How did I get here? Silence! The hall of your fathers must have many lumps and sharp rock speckles. Jeez, what are you complaining about? We even got you some straw. Which is to say, I did the best I could for a freeloader. Here, I made breakfast. Your first concert is today, so you need to get ready. Uh, rocks again. <laughs> he didn't complain about the food. That's an improvement. <laughs> you only complained a tiny bit. But but by the way, what is it? Have you contacted Yuya? You must be joking. I thought so. I have his address. Should I tell him about you? We need not worry him. I have no intention of asking favors of him. I didn't mean... Anyway, let it be. Things are fine as they are. I guess he's still a little chilly about Yuya. Maybe it's still too early. Let us go, Peckles. Okay! <laughs> Two heckles. Salutations! I trust you are well. A little bird told me you've been taking care of Sakuya. He's a pain, but I know you'll be able to handle him just fine. I have something to tell him. Something very important. Something I've been meaning to tell him his entire life. Since you're... Well, I guess I'm still a little, a little unsure myself. If he ever says he wants to see me, I'll think it over. When that time comes, let me know, okay? I'll keep in touch. Adieu. Sakazaki Yuya. Well, there we go. Oh. That was remarkably touching at the end. That was yeah. remarkably touching at the end. Ah, to be touched by birds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I had to take it there. Uh, I've eaten cool. nothing but rocks for the past week. <laughs> <laughs> and you will continue to eat rocks as a hunter-gatherer does. Excuse you. Your belly Eccles, shall Eccles be is a hunter-gatherer. Yeah, and I hunt and gather rocks. <laughs> <laughs> Some bugs do a very good job at night. Running away. <laughs> Saki is another bird with two endings. That makes sense. Song of the Foolish Bird. He is rather foolish. Yeah. Nice. Uh, we we... did two whole. We sure did. Uh, do we want We're to? We're done with Okosan. 
yeah, do we want to uh, get Okosan's second route? Uh, at this point, like, is this save at the point of, hey, I can just pick the other answer and I will get the other ending for, for Sakuya? No. Sakuya no. is a whole route you have to do again. Oh, jeez. Oh, I, oh, I think we messed up when we picked what we wanted to do about the world. Oh, for really? Sakuya? Didn't we? Because we didn't pick art, we picked rule for I mean, yeah, status. but you still got the good end. Oh, okay. Mm. You don't have to get every answer right to get the good end. Sakia's actually hinges on charisma, so good job! Ah! Nice! So we just have to have really bad charisma? Yes! Ah! Interesting! Which is why it's really annoying to get a skin ending. Ah, because we just uh, have, we have to, to do, do him twice. everything again. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, so uh, we, we've got to actually uh, at the point where he get our second ending, because there's only one fucking choice. Yeah. Uh, which was the Okosan save that we, uh... Uh, top right. Top right? Okay. Ah, yeah, student ID. Uh, you let's just skip ID. that if people are cool. Skip this. Elective day. Vitality. Fucking gym, yeah. More gym class. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta stay vitalized. Volleyball you are day. vitality, girl. Who would take this Okosan smash? Have at you! Alright, well, we're gonna... That's Jim. Alright, we're Goku, getting to... you have a lot of day for all doves. You're in a good mood, Okosan. Cool. Okosan was granted a vision in his dreams. Let's see. Uh, skippity doo da. Alright. Uh, you gotta pick the wrong one. The wrong one? Gotcha. <laughs> the indes... The in... Dis destructible? That's also a... Whatever. The indestructible pudding, which heals any injury. Cuckoo. Incorrect. Nonsense. Inconceivable. You don't understand, Hyoko. Oko-san wants no more of this. And he's gone. And you just do basically everything else is the same. The oh, only thing er that changes is the ending scene. Ah. All right. Time to la, fast la, 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 forward la, la, la. a lot. Mm. Cool, cool. Ah! Cool. It's a lot of slapping sounds. Ah. Ah. Track day! <laughs> Alright, I kind of want to see what happens if you make Okasan drink it. Sure. I think you've made enough like good decisions for him for that not to matter. <laughs> yeah, Come on, Okasan! You can do it if you don't want the true ending. <laughs> <laughs> he made it for you. You need to drink it. Cool. I force Son to the ground and make him drink the steroids. <laughs> uh oh. Bad <laughs> <Chad> friend. <laughs> Alright, Mike. Mike's still here. A mute. Mike. I am grateful to you, Monsieur. Oh, sorry, I was on mute. I'm there an idiot. <laughs> I am grateful to you, Miss Hoyoko. I am sure this will keep my research. <laughs> Okosan is out cold and twitching. The doctor uh, seems happy, but maybe uh, this wasn't a good idea. <laughs> you poisoned your romantic interest. Whoops. <laughs> anyway. There's only a little poison. <laughs> it's just a little poison. Uh, uh, pick does... convenience store just in case. I don't know why this is the correct answer. They're both wrong. They're both but... wrong. <laughs> but this is less wrong. <laughs> All right, you did bad, kid. Happy New Welcome Year. There is no rain. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Still light like out. Like in times, get him like hemp get for those bonus points. Hemp. Here, Okosan. Here, here are beans. Confess my cool. undying love for you. Cool. Despite poisoning you like four months ago. Anyway, it's February. Cool. <laughs> All right. Go, Go with, him. with him. I'm coming with you. What? Their maiden. This quest will be mortally dangerous. I don't care if this true pudding really exists. I want to find it with you. Cool. Hmm. Oko-san knows your abilities well, Hyoko. You will not be an impediment. 
so you'll take me with you. Ooh, very well. Birds of a feather must flock together, after all. Let's go. Cool. Until we catch the end of the rainbow. The rainbow. The gold beneath the virtual rainbow. And so... I am bereft of two human things. <laughs> our great quest began. Again. Oh. It yeah. just it just yeah, ends. It's, it's pretty lame. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well then. Easy save you're, points for their endings. Mm -hmm. You're just perpetually on a quest now with Oko san. Yeah. You yeah. never find true pilloting and then you die. And then ah, you sad. die. Oko san uh, hey, never the government didn't kill you. Mortality. <laughs> Two yeah. things an Oko san right. can never do. Two things that stand between Oko-san and humanity. Death and to vomit. <laughs> Tell me a second ending is also pretty fast if you wanted to see it. Oh yeah? Okay. Yeah. We're, we're pretty much at the at the same point of just, instead yeah. of saying the bike, just say the other one. Yeah. Gotcha. I and should bring up. the romance. <laughs> anyway, martial arts. <laughs> yeah. We are getting some serious, like... <laughs> Whiplash. Yeah. I'm right traveling. Asami, I don't think you've forgotten Mr. Fava Bean. What's all this, Heckles? I think you think about him all the time, even now. What are you talking about, kid? You practice your elegant kicking technique every day, right? You've been preparing a special move for your reunion with him, right? It kicks. You're right. I have. I don't like where this is going. Grit your teeth, Mr. Fava Bean. You'll regret dumping me until the day you die. Womp. Thud. Oh, you just got his ass kicked. And so, the oasis of soothing parakeetude was transformed into a scene of avian fury. The wrath of God falling to earth in the guise of a sparrow's legs. Oh my God. I never saw Azami or Mr. Fava Bean after that day. Oh, that wow. sucks. That fucking <laughs> yeah. sucked. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Is there not even, like, an achievement and ending or anything for that? Weird. Or... How was it supposed to end? Hmm. Well. Oh. No, that was, that was supposed to do the... Did we do something incorrect? No, I think that's right. I just maybe they updated it like at some point after I played it. Um, I thought choosing the martial arts one just immediately ended the game. Hmm. You're gonna want to speed run to the end real quick. Oh, you... oh, I I checked. Uh, our vitality was too low. Ah, oh, damn our it. Vitality was too low. Shit. Yeah. Well. <laughs> Not a vitality build this time. No, nah, not a vitality build. Mm -hmm. We tried to do too many things at once. Yeah, you gotta specialize. We'll have to do it some of someone else's time, because now yeah. you're just on Sakia again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, we can't, we can't, uh... Actually... I don't think we have a save on, uh... I don't think we have a save on Oko-san's before that, do we? I don't think we do. Oh, we do have the default save if we just want to, like... Yeah, I mean, we have default save if we want to do that. We also have this save, which could be, like, is this, like, going right towards Yuya's route? Which one? Uh, the top middle. Uh, no. Yuya's route, uh, you, the club choice is different. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. So then, I mean, do we want to speed run a vitality build just to get to the, uh, to the end of that? That makes sense, and you just do it like on Oko-san's path. thing is kind of cool. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I just forgot you needed Vitality. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Damn. Might uh, as well do it now while... Yeah. So since just it's... do Track Team Vitality. Yeah, since it's fresh in our minds. Yeah, and it's the Oko-san stuff, so we can just skip through it, because we've yeah. already seen it. You can just pick whatever choice you want, because it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter! Unless you die from the, the Hawk people. Oh, well, oh, I, oh. if I, I remember the martial arts one actually just starts the credits and does not stop the credits. Oh. Huh. Okay. Gym Which is why it's, it's kind of annoying to get if you accidentally pick that and you're on another route and different yeah. phase. Well, 
Then we're just gonna we're just gonna speed run. So uh, so what do we uh, what do we talk about for the next like twenty minutes as we're speed running this game? <laughs> um, the news is telling me Mandalorian three is coming out. That really? comes out out after the next season of, or the um oh Christ the Boba Fett show. Hmm. It's supposed to take Boba place Fett immediately show? after. There's the one in the world. Boba Fett. Ah. There's also the um the Obi Wan show happening right eventually yeah, too many Star Wars I don't know when that's shows. supposed to happen though hmm. uh, I so want to see a general grievous show but I guess it would have been the Clone Wars I, mean, like... I also want to see a general grievous show but like I want to see it from his perspective yeah I want to see him when he was cool and didn't oh, get yeah. taken yeah. out in five minutes cyborg. yeah I want to see the evolution <laughs> of him back when he was uh, just a hunter of Jedi <laughs> yeah. oh watch the Clone Wars I'm so badass They build him up so much in the movie, then they just immediately kill him the second he gets in a fight. Yep. Yeah. No character development whatsoever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you want to see take down Jedi, is... watch um, the Clone Wars, either the 2003 yeah. or yeah. like the more recent version. Uh, 2003 well, one's great, and it also has that. that stupid cough. Yeah, <sighs> 2003, Grievous fucks. He oh. sure does. Yeah. Mace Windu chokes him, and that's why he coughs in the movies. But there's, but yep, yep. without that context. That it's just really sound. It, he just kind of sounds stupid. Hmm. Hmm. Wait. <laughs> wait. I picked. I picked an answer that I haven't chosen before. Uh oh. <laughs> Leave it to me, Ryota. My hunter gatherer blood boils. <laughs> wait. What was the question? <laughs> you picked to stop Oko from cool. destroying the cop. No. Oh. The Beast Queen shows her true colors. Pull out. Pull out. <laughs> <laughs> Okosan rushes from the cafeteria <laughs> like a rabbit from a catapult. <laughs> That's what, very strange. What beautiful analogies this game has. <laughs> uh, safe at last. Thanks, Eccles. No problem. Queen. All I did was shout at him anyway. Apparently that was enough. Now we can all eat lunch without fear of disaster. Great. Back to speed running. Back to speed running. <laughs> Gym class. Gotta be thick. I don't know. Did anyone see Black Will? Thick, thick. thick. I yet. need to. Oh. My family watched it without me. Oh. How dare they? I know. They They're even jaspers. invited my cousins over and watched <laughs> it without me. Your cousins for you? Yeah. Yeah, they really went all in making sure everybody saw Chilica, what it made. Yeah. I saw no. Space Jam 2 the day it came out. How was it? I pirated it? Space Jam 2 two days after it came out. Was it good? It absolutely bombed in the box office its opening <laughs> week. So I'm gonna that go doesn't out. mean it's not good. That just means it's a sucky well, movie. It can no, still have humor good. value. The uh, 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 basketball uh, part was good. And Black Don Cheadle was good. I thought it made more money than Black Widow on its opening weekend. Probably. Probably I mean, for the memes, before not people because knew it was, it was bad. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, no. The the Onion had like three articles about Space Jam, and I think my favorite one was we sit down with Bugs Bunny to ask him how why he got sober for his role in Space Jam too. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. How LeBron James got him sober for his role in Space Jam too. Yeah. This new dialogue. Okosan, stop it. Cool. These are Oko-san's beams. You cannot interfere. Be quiet! Where is your pride as captain of the track team? Koo, come at me, whippersnapper. Whippersnapper? <laughs> and so Oof. began began a food fight that spanned several hours, the floor awash in blood and beans. What? Sorry. <laughs> hey, you're fighting Oko-san. He doesn't hold back. Koo, you've got guts. Oko-san will step down in light of your determination. You're... Bitch. You're not bad yourself, Oko-san. I think I just got rival zoned. Whoops. It sounds like a success story coming from him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're almost there, good. Carve it into your soul, kid. <laughs> Carve it into your soul, kid. Still have to do our job, though. Yeah, we have to do a job of fun. We can erase that. That's fine. There's only one choice in that. Yeah, there's only one choice. Get a job. Get a job. Get a job. 
Nah, but LeBron James. Oh, there's two ass, choices. So no one's gonna there's, be surprised. Two cho we have to choose to keep the job. Oh yeah. yeah that's and right. then the martial job. arts. And then martial arts. <laughs> do, uh, do, do the it. job I was hired for. Let's that not, would have been tragic. Let's not mess that up. <laughs> Now we just get to sit through this. Yeah. It's fine. Boxing birds. See, this this part of the city looks fine. Yeah, yeah. but the moon looks weird. Yeah. Does it? <laughs> I forgot it about like... the function. <laughs> it looks like a summer festival on like a, an Ursa ring. Teddy Ursa. The moon mm. look there looks like what's on a Teddy Ursa more than anything. More than the moon itself. Half moon thing? Mm. Oh, I hate this. There's Rambu. There we go. Ah, so you have chosen death. <laughs> yeah. No, we've not Wait. chosen the death ending. Okay. No, um... I think we're almost there. We're almost there. We're fine. Everything's fine. There she is. They're, They're both start, in the room. Uh, fading and having stressful conversations. Blaster. There we Bobbine. go. Martial, Martial Arts. <laughs> Martial Arts. <sighs> Azami, I don't think you've forgotten Mr. Fava Bean. Uh, Ian is muted. Ian is muted. <laughs> All right. Just to see you to dispense itself. So I know this heckles. <laughs> <laughs> I, f I think you think about him all the time. Even now. Especially now. What are you talking about, kid? You practice your elegant kicking technique every day, right? You've been preparing that. a special move for your reunion with him, right? Thanks. You're right, I have. Break your teeth, Mr. Fafa Bean. You'll regret dumping me until the day you die. One thud. One foot. <laughs> and so the oasis of soothing parakeet tood was transformed into a scene of avian fury. The wrath of God failing, falling to earth in the guise of a sparrow's legs. <laughs> I'll decimate my there summer homework with the force of a raging bull. Next up is the individual research project. I want to research something that will only take one day, but I don't really have any ideas. Anyway, I'll take a stroll around town and see if I can find anything, if I find an interesting topic. Huh? Standing in front of a used bike shop is... A, a zombie? Exclamation point. Oh, it's you. Kids like you should head home and get some sleep already. A zombie, were... Were you crying? <laughs> what are you talking about? Don't make fun of me. S sorry, but as you're protege i am i really am worried about you making my half-grown protege worry i must be losing my edge when i look around her trademark pink scooter is nowhere to be seen and she came out of the used bike shop which means no way did did you sell your bike if you're having second thoughts i'll go take it back for you nah it's fine this is my way of ending things and now that it's over, I'll look to the future. That is the way of the sparrow. The way of the sparrow. That sounds pretty cool! Goodbye, Mr. Fava Bean. It's time for me to move on. I reckon I'll see you later. Punk. <laughs> hey, you was guys. Hey. <laughs> you were the guys who were picking on, uh, who picked a fight with my, uh, cute followers, huh? Yeah, get him, bro! Yeah, get him! <laughs> it's the gang of bad birdies from before. So you brought your friends. Chicks like you should be at home washing their beaks and getting ready for bed. Oh, don't look down on us. We brought our best fighters to pay you back. You better be ready. These doves are strong. Ganging up on her isn't fair, you punkjins. Azami, I'll help too. 
The pumpkins come up at us one after another. In just an instant, the nighttime city transforms into a violent battlefield. Azami lays down the smackdown with her magnificent sparrow kick, and I pulverize everything with my fists of fury. We're at a huge disadvantage, but Azami and I pull through and live to see the dawn. I ran out of budget to animate that? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> what budget? I only thought you were something special. We've gotten pretty strong. No, I still have a long ways to go. No. You're already a true sparrow. Uh, I'm a sparrow? What do you mean, Azami? I'm 100% human. You know, no birdie's born a sparrow. You overcome obstacles and suffer hardships. Still always move forward. That's what makes some birdie a sparrow. <laughs> I guess I'm not a sparrow. Yeah. <laughs> your kindness, your strength, your way of life. Everything about you screams sparrow. From this day forth, hold your head high and call yourself a sparrow. A zombie. I am a sparrow. Sparrow heckles peckles, and no pumpkin is a match for me. Feel it in my bones. I can trust you. If we're together, there's nothing we can't do. I'll be counting on you, kid. Yeah! Azami and I formed a new all-girl delinquent gang. Carve it into your soul. <laughs> Only our souls run wild. Our wild birds embodied that noble spirit as we drove through the night never once breaking any traffic laws. And so we became legends of the Midnight Roads. All right, that never was- Never breaking that was... traffic laws. Yeah. Wow. That, that was, was nice. That was a good ending. That, that was, was great. Good. Well worth the speed good. run. <laughs> Is there an actual Girl, speed run reference punch to this shit game? Out of everyone. Oh. I, I'm curious, hold on. We're going to speedrun.com. As you see, yeah, what's the speed run record? There's gotta be. Uh, speedrun.com. Uh, Hato <laughs> Full Boyfriend. It's too uh, speedrunny. Categories, right? Uh, I don't know if it exists. I don't know if it exists on on speedrun.com. Let's see. No, no, I'm not. It's, uh. 535. I, I see a video for a speedrun is done in 328. Three minutes and 28 seconds? Yeah, all of a sudden, like, speedrun.com is, like, not loading anything up for me. Oh. Uh, been knowledge. So it may or may not exist. The world may never know. Oh. The world what do we make may our own? never know. I guess visual novels don't usually have a speedrunning community. <laughs> true, Java true Java Sparrow. True Java Sparrow. Oh, that was nice. Nice. Okay, I'm. So in this game, is it just like a full-grown human fighting pigeons? Yes. Yeah. 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 Uh, that's for sure. Uh, let's... I think that's enough routes for today. Yeah. Yeah. We yeah. did. We did a full four. That's a. That's a lot of no. yeah. Well done, everyone. Well done. Oh, this Fuck is. Speed run to fuck it up. We'll have to wait. Yeah. Yeah. We'll uh. We'll speed run Saki to just just screw it up. Oh boy. Oh, what an geez. exciting day, though. Oh, very, 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 very exciting. <laughs> just talking with the can of beans. Yeah, just, just beans. Beans, you <laughs> know, baked beans. Constant beans. <laughs> okay, that's a good thing to end on for me. Yeah. Yeah. I am gonna kill the stream. I'm gonna put on the the end slate. Is there any way to prep for Yuya through Safia's bad route? No. Yuya is a completely separate route. You have okay. to pick a different club. Okay. Alright, so he works, next time. He works in the infirmary. If you remember uh... from the sport festival, that's how you figure it out. Ah, uh, gotcha. Uh, so like next time tent. we, we speedrun uh, uh, Safia's Safia. bad ending, and then we go with the doctor, perhaps? Sure. Oh. Sounds like a good idea. No Just like with the okay. doctor That's order. Good. Yeah. Be careful with Sakia's second ending. You have to pick all the correct answers still. Just never go to music class. <laughs> ah, okay. You have to not be charismatic. Uh. But you still have to get the right answers. For the doctor, do we finally get to be smart and not fail our tests? Yes. <laughs> yeah, you have to go to math class because you got to impress him yep. with your smarts. Yeah. But do you really want to? Uh. Maybe. I mean, do you want to? in order to get the ending, I feel like we have to. 
That's fair. We'll see. 